Hi guys, it's Michael here and thank you for joining me on another quick tutorial here at Educating Abroad. So in this tutorial we're going to be looking at how to create an attractive teacher video resume. Now first thing you might be asking, well, why do I need one? Well, recent studies have proven that you're far more likely to receive contact or even an interview from hiring managers and employers such be it international schools or language centres if you have a teacher video resume compared to not having one and just a, 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 a CV or a written resume. And that's based on uh, people with similar skills and experience. Now, unfortunately, international teacher recruitment is a little bit behind when it comes to using this type of technology. But fortunately, we do have it here at Educating Abroad. So what I want to share with you today is, is two parts, two things. Uh, one is how to create an attractive teacher video resume. And we'll do this by showing you two videos, one which is a bad version of how not to do it. And then secondly, a, a good or a better version of, of how to do it and, and look at the differences between the two. The second part is uh, how to upload that into YouTube and then finally get that into Educating Abroad so it shows on your profile for hiring managers, international schools, language centres and anyone else for them to see. Now, before we start, there's a couple of things that we do need. Well, you'll need a laptop or a mobile phone with a camera. Um, you'll need a, a Google account and YouTube account. You'll also need an Educating Abroad profile and finally Wi-Fi or mobile internet data so you can log on and access them. Okay, so all that in order, uh, we'll jump into the, the first part which is looking at the two, uh, two videos. So I'm going to show you uh, uh, the initial video first of all. Have a look at it, see what you think. Hopefully you'll find a few things in there that you think, wow, uh, and then we can talk over them at the end. So let's, let's begin. Hi, this is uh, my video uh, resume. Um, I'm looking for a teaching job, um, ideally in Vietnam. Uh, some of that I've always been keen to do. Um, I've left my details down in the uh, in my profile. Oops. Um, so yeah, um, I'm, yeah, I'm uh, I've been teaching for a, a couple of years. I've got a TEFL certificate. Thanks. Right, so hopefully no one out there will be thinking, wow, that's really good. <laughs> hopefully everyone will join me in thinking that was pretty tragic. Now, unfortunately, it's not a one-off and don't be led to believe that that's the worst you'll ever see. Um, myself, who's had roughly 10 years experience in recruitment, hiring teachers and, and other skill sets, and my co-founder, who's a head teacher at an international school, we sort of agreed on roughly one out of every three video resumes we've seen that's similar to that, which is pretty scary. But we do put it down to practice and, and, it, and practice makes perfect. Okay, so as you can see, there's quite a lot wrong with that from uh, looking disinterested, uh, the presentation wasn't right, the angle was off on the camera, uh, what he was wearing wasn't too great, etc. Okay, so... We'll put that to one side and I'm going to show you another one um, and hopefully have a look at it and some of the corrections. Hi, thanks for uh, looking at my profile. Just before I start, and a quick disclaimer is I'm not a teacher uh, by profession, so forgive me in terms of what I say, but please just focus on how I say it and how I present myself. You guys are the teachers out there, you know exactly what to say about your profession and your skills and so on. Uh, but yeah, so just, just a quick disclaimer. Let's Let's restart it. Educating abroad, uh, so I believe I've got two minutes to try and wow you into thinking that I'm the best person for your position at your international school or language centre. Um, now I don't really want to go and talk about uh, all my experience because uh, that's in my profile anyway. So you'll see things like that. I've got my uh, certificate of education, my PGCE, and uh, my degree in education as well. Um, but what I want to talk to you about um, ideally is my philosophy, my teaching philosophy, as I think that will give you a better, in, uh, better understanding of, of how I would be uh, within your school. Um, so my, uh, my philosophy is very much based around uh, the students um, and believing that developing a strong and trusting relationship is the key to ensuring the success of uh, the students to, uh, for them to thrive. Um, ensuring that they feel safe, comfortable and... 
Okay, I'll save you the pain <laughs> of, of any more or, or more of that. Um, but yeah, as you, as you can hopefully tell by looking at the second video, you'll see quite a stark contrast between the two uh, in terms of what I'm wearing, how I'm facing the camera, the angle of the camera. Uh, I look interested. Uh, so yes, so hopefully you'll see the difference between the two. What I would do say is if you're ever looking to uh, one of the questions that I get asked quite often about how to record a video resume or even uh, how to uh, conduct a face-to-face -face interview is treat it like you're with them face-to-face -face, as if you're sat in front of them dress appropriately sit up straight speak loudly speak proudly and give your best effort it is the your your introduction your shop window for someone to hopefully think you're the right person from for my school for my job i'm going to give you a call i'm going to call you in for an interview okay great that's that part over and done with and to be fair that's the hardest part uh completed so what i'm going to look at now is how we can upload that into youtube and then finally get that into the educating abroad profile so if we head over to uh, youtube.com and what you'll need is as i mentioned earlier you'll need a google account to enable you to get a a YouTube account so once you've got your YouTube account set up what you'll need to do is go to this icon here in the top right click it and it'll give you some more options there as well and then we just go to upload video and it should come up with a file yet yeah. so just click select file so I'm going to choose the second video because I believe that was the best one. Hopefully you will uh, you will agree. So that'll upload and then give us a couple of options to choose from. So the title part is one of the more important options to look at. Now what will happen is when your video is present on Educating Abroad Profile, before the, the hiring manager or the school clicks play, it'll have some information around it and one of them is a title which is quite prominent so what I say to get the best uh, the, the best publicity is to call it by your first name and last name your name and then my teacher video resume and I'll show you why that's important later on in the video in the tutorial okay so in terms of description you don't have to put anything there at all and in you the other ones is the only thing you have to click here is it's not made for kids uh, and that is it that's all you need to do on this page now unfortunately it might have got really slow internet so rather than you waiting there looking at my ugly mug what i'll do is uh, i'll just pause you for a brief second wait for that to upload and then i'll come and bring you back hi guys so that's now done and uploaded two years ago now i'm only joking it took about four minutes to upload that really so give give or take four or five minutes to allow that to to upload now before we move on from this section uh, as you can see the the thumbnails unfortunately it wasn't very kind now youtube sort of picks out what it thinks is a good uh, thumbnail to have as the sort of image before someone presses play uh now unfortunately my all three of mine are pretty pretty terrible so what i would personally do is i'd, up, I'd take a screenshot of one that's just normal facing and i'd upload it there and save it hopefully you won't need to do that and you'll get a better one to choose from so we'll just quickly go with that one for 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 this tutorial and then we'll go to click next we don't need to do anything on the video elements screen and just click next to visibility now this part is is quite important and it's this part here which says unlisted now the reason why me personally i would choose unlisted is because i don't want my video resume to show up on youtube channels youtube lists or, or anywhere else for that matter in advertisements or anything so what unlisted does is it allows you to share a link and wherever you've shared that link people can see that so you might want to send it to a friend so they can review it and say yeah it looks really good you've done well there or i would do this to improve it etc and also for when you share it on educating abroad hiring managers and schools are able to see you as well it's up to you by all means if you want to hopefully become famous from your teacher video resume by all means put it on public but me personally i'll put it on unlisted but that's that's your choice to make
And the final part we need to do with YouTube, and the last bit is this part here, which is the video link. Now, this is the part that we're going to use to add to your educating a broad profile. So what I would advise is just to click copy, open up a notepad, and just save it there for the time being so you can come quickly back to that in, in uh, when, when you need it. Okay, so that's that part over and done with. So now we'll jump into Educating Abroad and you'll hopefully have your profile set up. And then what you'll need to do is go to My Resume and you can either do it there or here, whichever suits you best. And this is my demo account uh, in the name of Bob Hope, who hopes to get a, a future international teaching job. And what we'll do is we'll scroll down to this part that says my video resume. Now it is a premium feature, so you would need to purchase it by clicking here. And we should come to the, uh, the shop page and it'll tell you a little bit more about it. So the price, uh, the reason behind why it's important, and then once you've had a look at that, just click add to basket. And then make sure everything's right on the checkout page, uh, on the basket page, just click to check out. So candidate video resume, price, quantity and then just fill out your normal billing details as you normally would again make sure everything's okay and then fill out your credit card details uh, now like I said this is a demo demo account so I'll just fill in some demo details unfortunately this won't be available to you uh, so it would mean uh, uh, paying uh, with your own on money uh, But the good news is, is and I'm not sure if you're uh, you're aware, but any profit that's made through educating abroad, 20% of it goes to a chosen children's charity, which is actually chosen by you guys. So we put up a, a selection of five or six different charities, and then you guys get to choose who that will go to at the end of the year. And you can do that by going into our teacher zone and then the staff room, which is our teacher forum. Okay, so that looks like it's gone through. So now if we go back to my profile page, uh, sorry, my resume, where it had the click here sign, we should now have a box where we can put in a URL uh, uh, of our video, which will show up on the, uh, on the front end on your profile. Brilliant. So that's there. But before we go into that, what I want to just show you is the demo account of how that looks. So this is Bob Hope's profile. And as you can see, there's a bit about me, his description, education, work experience, etc. But no video resume. So let's go into uh, back into this profile. Let's get that URL link that we saved from earlier. Copy that. And let's paste that in there. And let's just go to the bottom, update it. Now the good thing with this is once you've purchased this uh, uh, the teacher video resume, you can change it as many times as you like. So you're not just you don't have to just keep that one. And, and if there is something that you just don't like about it, you can always go back and change it and upload it as many times as you like. Um, so let's go back to to Bob's profile. Let's uh, refresh the page and let's see if it goes there. Fantastic, and there it is. And as you can see what I mentioned earlier about the title of the video, so there it shows my name, Michael Roach, my teacher video resume. So it's really easy and clear to see for any hiring managers and in international schools who want to look at it. And they can just click play, and then that'll, uh, that'll upload for you uh, and show it. And that's it. That's all you have to do uh, in order to get a fantastic, amazing teacher video, video resume on Educating Abroad. Well, good luck to everyone. We hope to see some fantastic video resumes in the near future. If you have any questions, queries, or uh, anything like that, by all means, contact us on LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, anything or anything on our website, in the forum, and we're more than happy to come and help you if we can. Thanks very much. Have a good day. Thank you.